Jordan versus Dominique at Chicago Stadium in 1988. Vince Carter at Golden State in 2000. Or Spud at Reunion Arena in Dallas back in 1986. All memorable, rim-shaking moments indeed. But where do they rank among the top 10 greatest dunks in the history of the slam dunk contest? Here's the list, starting at 10 and leading up to number one. Bring it! Number 10 from 1976, the man who started it all, flying from the foul line, the doctor. And that sends everyone really. Julius Irving. At number 9 from 1990, Dominique gets nasty. Just watch Isaiah and Magic react. Ooh. A two-handed windmill jam. Said his Atlanta teammate came up. You saw the look of Magic Johnson and Isaiah Thomas. At number eight from 1988, Michael Jordan with his ode to the doctor edges out Dominique in their classic battle. They gave him a 50. They gave Jordan a 50. He defends his championship. At number seven, from 2003, Desmond Mason shows the ball with the right, then brings it home with the left. Oh! 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 That is freaky right there. That is freaky. Everybody got to remember, it was with the left, left hand. hand, too. We need to get him a get well card. He's <laughs> sick right now. <laughs> At number six from 2004, Jason Richardson goes off the glass and then between the legs. That is sick. He's got the flu. He's sick. At number five in 2000, Vince Sanity electrifies the crowd with a 360 windmill. Here is Vince Carter with his first shot. Let's go home. Let's go home, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go home. This building just exploded. At number four from 1987, MJ kisses the rim on his way to his first dunk title. Oh, Oh, I love it. He went straight to the basket just like he was floating on air. Turned sideways, gave a little little move to the side, and floated sideways to throw it in. Look at the air, look at the hang time, look at the flying motion. At number three, from 1986, the most diminutive dunk champ ever shows the big guys how to do it. Oh my goodness. John, this young man has been so impressive. Now the timing that that ball should bounce just right, he meets it at the height and does a reverse. At number two from 2003, Jay Rich gets the All-Stars out of their seats with this one. And at number one, again, it's Vince, and like Kenny Smith says, it's over. Oh, it's over! It's over, ladies and gentlemen! 